widow of a highly decorated U.S. Army colonel from Greenwich is continuing her husband's legacy, providing a voice and a platform to soldiers here and all across the country. Our Shirlene Alicock introduces us to Elise England, this week's News 12 Connecticut Webster Bank hometown hero. We're already starting to look for sponsors. Elise England has turned her Greenwich kitchen into a makeshift office. We function as investigative reporters and, and provide the frontline troops with a platform where they can come and tell us what's going on and what's wrong. The organization Soldiers for the Truth sheds light on many issues soldiers face. We broke the story um, last December on the Pfizer drug that was causing, so, you know, like warriors uh, back from the front lines to become homicidal, suicidal. The goal is to become their voice. These soldiers protect our way of life, don't they? So shouldn't we be standing up as citizens to protect them the way they protect us? She's continuing the legacy of her late husband, Colonel David Hackworth. David um, is America's most valor decorated soldier of all time. Several years ago, the two penned this book on the lives of 300 frontline soldiers when Hackworth was a lieutenant colonel in the Vietnam War. Four years after his death, the organization is still going strong. So what would he think? He'd be saying, at a girl. And that's why I do it. In Greenwich, Shirley Nalicock, 